the Ruben 12 is a member of the compact disc family of Lumpkin. We will discuss the service and field preparation for this unit. The Ruben 12 is equipped with the hydraulic drawbar, where once the hydraulic hoses are attached to the tractor, then the hydraulic drawbar can be moved up and down until the proper height where you could hitch onto your tractor. On the Ruben 12, there's one indicator for both depth and the drawbar. Once the machine is level, which can be done on a flat surface or in the field, you can make the adjustment. The red arrow is for your working depth. The other arrow is for your drawbar. So once the unit is level, you just have to set the drawbar setting at the same setting as the depth. And this is done by just inserting the rod into the whole mechanism so that both settings are the same. If the main frame is on level, the adjustment is made at the cylinder. By cracking the cylinder and reducing its pressure, you could then increase or decrease the number of treads, which then increase or decrease the length of your rod. If the locking mechanism needs some adjustment, therefore still need to crack the, the, uh, the cylinder to relieve the pressure, but then you make the adjustment at the clevis. The rebound arrow controls the flow of soil and residue between the first and the second row of disc. It should not touch the soil so that the residue can go underneath it. To adjust the height of the tine harrow, you just need to raise or lower the mechanism. The leveling tines are used to level the soil before the rollers. It should touch the soil to make it sure that the soil is level. To adjust the height of the leveling tines, you just need to raise or lower the mechanism. In order to adjust the outside disc, you just need to loosen the bolt, raise it or lower it at the proper height so that you do not have any ridges. In order to raise or lower the side plates, these two bolts need to be loosened and then the plate can be moved down, up and down, and the bolts inserted into the slot. If changing parts for the disassembly is necessary, have to be remembered that the disc bolt needs to be tightened at 80 newton meter and the axle for the bearing at 500 newton meter. After the initial two hours of use, the bolts at the rim need to be retorqued and that setting is at 380 newton meters. 